In today's tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to create a buttery smooth hyperzoom hyperlapse effect in DaVinci Resolve 17 free version. Let's jump into the edit page, but first let's see today's intro. Welcome to another tutorial in DaVinci Resolve 17. Currently we are in edit page and today I'm going to show you really the easiest and the fastest way how to build up time-lapse hyper-zoom effect in the DaVinci Resolve 17 free version. You can see that I have already put a video clip onto my timeline. You can see that this is drone uh, footage. First thing that we need to do is uh, just highlight this clip, go to right-click and generate optimized media why? Because you will need all the GPU and CPU. Uh, if you uh, just uh, working with one short clip, there is no problem at all. But you can still see that need 10 to 15 seconds to uh, optimize this media. So now the media is optimized. So if you have more than one clip, just go to new compound clip, change it to compound clip and uh, I don't need to do that because I only have one uh, and all the, the video clips that you have uh, change to the same speed uh, I will just go with that uh, and I will show you so we have new compound clip already so next thing is let's go to change clip speed and you can change it here to 1000 or even more depends the uh, how long the clip is and you can change it like this so that this clip will be on the end uh, four seconds long a bit more and uh, this is the clip that we have here so looks nice but the speed is quite right so you can go even faster if you want to so you can change it immediately uh, just right click go to change clip speed and change it to even more you can go like 5,000 9,000 percent of the current speed and uh, that's the first step that we need to do uh, to produce this effect so next thing is let's jump into the color page into the color page you can see that we have all the usual tools so let's go to open FX, click on it and you have under the resolve FX blur also zoom blur and just drag and drop to the clip. So now we have this zoom effect, blur zoom effect uh, and it will look really cool. So if we go like this, but it's a bit messy, it's a bit uh, heavy for our eyes. So we're gonna change a few things. We're gonna just use the new thing in the DaVinci Resolve 17. So we can just uh, exclude uh, the, the center. So it will be clear. You can see it here that the center it's uh, clear and it's not blurred at all. So we can increase or decrease the zoom blur. So we can go with a clear image at all uh, definitely a clear image or we can just add some zoom so it will look like warp so let's see what's happened now so it's like a really crazy look uh, you can focus on on one thing so in this tool you also have options so you can just go and change the uh, X and Y so you can basically go directly and keyframe if you want to have like uh, this uh, church in, 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 in zoom all the time so we can go back we can just change here also like this and this is we can play it through to see what will happen now so the bell tower is um, is basically inside this uh, zoom that we have so it's visible all the time and you can basically 
uh, directed viewer what to watch so this is the fastest way really to to do this effect that's it for today if you have any uh, questions regarding this effect let me know down in comments and uh, thank you for watching see you next time if you find this tutorial helpful hit that thumbs up leave your feedback suggestion or comments below and if you are new to this channel don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to watch my other tutorials as well till next time take care and have a good one